before we start this video, I just want to say I was one of the bigger Denis Gurionov fans after the 2015 NHL entry draft. I remember what Craig Button was talking about about that draft, saying that among that class, the two best snipers that he felt were the most underrated were Denis Gurionov, who got selected by the Dallas Stars, and Brock Besser, who eventually became Vancouver Canucks property. But, with that being said, let's segue into today's interesting topic, and that is, we have just witnessed, well, not we have just witnessed, but we are witnessing, because I'm recording this game as the Flames and Stars game is actually still going on, because come on, the Flames are not going to come back, they're not going to win this game, they're pretty much eliminated right now. But we have just witnessed what I'm going to be calling the most embarrassing loss of the 2020 Stanley Cup playoffs, and that includes the play-in series. You could say whether or not, oh, the Toronto losses were worse, because Toronto was in a position where they needed to win, they had all this pressure, and against a Columbus team that wasn't supposed to be this good, they blew it. Okay, you could make that argument. But, to me, when I think of embarrassment, I think of... You had it, you lost it. I think of Gretzky. Had it, lost it, boom, it's in the back of the net, you're done. I think of situations where a team has a realistic ability to come out on top, but they completely blow it. And in this game, we saw the Flames completely blow it times 10. It was the worst way you could blow this kind of game. Context for those who are unaware, the Flames were heading into this game down 3-2 in their first round Stanley Cup playoff series. It had been a back and forth battle between the Flames and the Stars. People were betting on the Flames because they said the Stars' big problem is that they can't score goals. So, after a back and forth series, eventually Dallas wins two in a row, and now they're heading into game six with a 3-2 lead, one more win, and they're in the second round. Well... This game started out great for the Flames. Three goals in three minutes in the first period. And all of a sudden, Flames fans all over are cheering, yes, this is the team that we wanted. This is the team that we saw. This is our team that we know can defeat the Dallas Stars. Yes! But then the Flames let up six straight goals and, um, yeah, you know, you had it, you lost it. That's pretty much it. I'm gonna say that all the stuff talking about, oh, the Flames played well in this part of the game, or Johnny Gaudreau looked really good towards the third period, or there were some moments where the Flames looked legitimately great, but I don't care about any of that. The bottom line is you're still losing, the bottom line is you're still gonna lose, and in a game that is probably the most important game you've played in like five years pretty much, because you haven't had any form of playoff success before, and you hadn't really had any chance of beating the Ducks in 2017, and the Avalanche in 2019, and you breeze by the Jets in 2020 in the play-in series, but now this is the most important game because you guys have a realistic chance of being able to come back and win the series. There is a very vocal part of the hockey community, myself included, saying that the Flames could beat the Stars, and in fact, I said that the Flames would do that because we know how good they could be. And in a game where they're up 3-0 with their backs against the wall, they need to win this game to even up the series, they blow it. They completely blow it. Six straight unanswered goals to the team that many people said couldn't score any goals. Talbot crumbled under the pressure. The Stars got their mojo back on. They pulled Talbot and put in David Riddich after three goals, and then he let in another three goals that really didn't look all too great, and now their Flames are going to lose. I'm saying it right here, man. The most embarrassing loss of the 2020 Stanley Cup playoffs. Dallas, enjoy your run into the second round. Oh my gosh, make that seven straight goals. Gorionov just got his fourth. R.I.P. Calgary Flames, man. But I hope you enjoyed this video for that Trost 99. I'm seriously recording this as the game's still going on. And bye.